Welcome back. Some of the Sons of Anarchy cast will be in town this weekend. They will be in town. I know this is a lot of people's favorite Nick. show. Well, get this. Esteban actually had a chance to talk to one of the stars, Kim Coates, and all of the details about this weekend. Check it out. The boot ride benefiting the boot camp game is this weekend. So how do, you, how do you feel about it being in Texas since it's been in L.A. the last three years? Yeah, Sherry Rulin, our fearless leader, and Megan McDermott uh, with the boot campaign. We've, we, this is the fourth annual, as you said. The other three, uh, we're all in California. It was super successful, but it's time to branch out. You know, it's time to go to other parts of America and, and show what the boot campaign is all about. And this boot uh, ride and rally is so, so successful. Um, we can't wait to get out there. Yeah, it sounds awesome. I can't wait to see it down here. And matter of fact, what inspired you to get involved in showing gratitude to the U.S. troops? You know, it's a big thing. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm Canadian. Uh, I'm, I'm American now as well, but I'm Canadian first, and uh, I support all the troops. Um, you know, I, 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 I want them all coming home now. I, I want, and I'm, we should be taking care of them when they do, you know. They, they, come, they come back, we got to give back, and the boot campaign is one of those nonprofits that that gives uh, all, all, their, all their money and resources back to these troops that come home from downrange. And, and for me to be an ambassador with Theo Rossi, who plays Juice on the show, on our show, uh, we're just uh, very fortunate guys that, uh, that, that to totally support the troops. And it's, it's, it's my pleasure, and, and I'll keep doing it forever. Well, we thank you, we thank you. So how has being involved in boot campaign impacted you and the guys around you? A lot. It's a great question. A lot of us guys from the show, I, I think I've done two USO tours, uh, 10 countries around the world, Iraq, Kuwait, Hawaii, Guam. Uh, we, we've been everywhere. Yeah, we've been everywhere. So we, uh, it's impacted me a lot. And this, this fourth annual in San Antonio, this, this coming Sunday, the second, if people want to come up, there's still tickets left at bootride.com. Yeah, yeah boot, go to bootride.com bootride for some tickets that are still available. There's going to be bands playing. It's kid-friendly. Uh, it's just an amazing atmosphere, and, and please come out and support. Oh, we definitely will. We'll get the Harleys route up and whatever bikes we can find. But, you know, being that it's in Texas, actually San Antonio area right now, what makes uh, this boot ride so different from the other ones? I guess we're about to find out. You know, this is, <laughs> this is our first annual, so you, you need to talk to me when it's all done. Uh, it's just packed. It's just an incredible atmosphere with all the bands playing and all the food and the drinks and and the ride's pretty special, and, and, and the warriors that will be there that we're going to be honoring uh, on Sunday. Um, it's going to be a ton of fun, and I can't wait to get there. And if you can't wait to get to the fourth annual boot ride and rally, it's November 2nd at Caliente Harley-Davidson at 1 p.m. Bootride.com is the website. But guess what? We're giving away a family four-pack of tickets right now to the ninth caller, 470-5222. You're going. Very good. And you're welcome. And I'll be there. And stay with us. <laughs> we'll be right back. You will be there. I will Are you going to get on the there. hog and ride down? No. Down